This is a brief demonstration of CMI Standards Manager's layer theming capability where we can manage the same layer name with different layer properties between uh, different disciplines. First, to make this all happen, we're going to go ahead and copy a layer group from our standards here from the topography group. We're going to copy this layer group and we're going to paste this layer group that exists within survey into the uh, civil layers. Once within the civil layers, now we have copies of those layers and you'll see, see that show up as we click the layers tab, you'll notice that we have a new component, the survey initial component. From here we're going to go ahead and hide the layer component and this way we will not be available to that discipline, civil in this case, to be able to actually create the layer only to work with the layer. And you'll see it highlighted in blue. From there we can go ahead and change the layer properties within now the civil topography group and you notice we've had a couple of new layers added, the V topo major and V topo minor. We're going to go ahead and change the properties from what they were within the civil group. So we'll reset the colors. We'll ultimately reset the line types within this so that we'll be able to see and manage this and plot it differently. Maybe we can go ahead and at this point we'll use the multi-layer capability selection where we can go through and we'll select a, a line type here. In this case, let's go ahead and select something like dashed. And from here, let's also go ahead and, and adjust the plotting so we plot this at 50% screen and ba in a style-based setup. This is a uh, SDB plotting setup that's used in this particular standard. From at this point now, in order to make this all work on the user side, we, know we need to go ahead and build the complete layer list. This is a layer indexing so we have really fast access for the end users. So we're going to go ahead and create this for this particular setup and then at this point we'll be able to use it within the user module. Once this is complete, we'll go ahead and go back within AutoCAD now. And we've been working outside of AutoCAD to this point. So let's go ahead and open a file where I have an X reference topography drawing already in it. It's all set up for the survey colors. You probably noticed that it was kind of a greenish color, so you note that. Also, I want to let you know that we are, you know, we're going to go ahead and assign it to the current standard and show that it is assigned to the NCS4. And at this point, we'll go ahead and reset colors and line types for that X reference. So we'll go ahead and select that X reference. It's called Topo. We'll say OK. And at this point, it brings up and says, here's the two disciplines that are available. Let's pick Civil and then let's go ahead and set up the Civil theme.